We're here with sophomores Kayla Wilson and Lindsey Brewer. I'll uh, ask you all a couple sets of questions. I'll we'll start with you, Kayla. You come into this game on a slump. Uh, 3 of 15 into this game, the first game, back-to-back -back RBI singles. What does that do for your confidence? Obviously coming in on a little bit of a low, but what does that do for your confidence? Uh, it definitely boosted me up because I knew that I had to do something and step up, especially, especially since Coach put me at fourth. He, before the game, he asked me, he was like, I'm putting at you at fourth, are you going to come through for me? And I said, yes, sir. And he said, you're never going to lie to me. And I didn't. <laughs> so it really helped a lot. I think you played first in the first game, if I'm not mistaken, and then you came in and played in the outfield. Mm -hmm. Do you usually play in the outfield? That's where I started last year was in right field. Okay, so Coach is comfortable putting you in different positions then, obviously. All right, we'll go to you, Lindsay. You, you catch every game. Um, I, one of our players is hurt, so you're there every game. What does that do to your body? I mean, you've caught now, I, I guess we're, let's see, 10 games now. You've caught every game. It's tiring, but I'm not going to give up, and I'm going to keep going and be behind my team. You had two hits in each game. Um, so, obviously, y'all are seeing the ball well. What does it do for your mindset when you play so well and we out hit them the first game 11 to 10, but then you come up a run short in both games? What, what does that do to your confidence level? It's upsetting, but knowing that we all do played our best, then, I mean, that's all we can do. We got an inspired speech from Coach Rowan on the bus. Obviously, nobody heard it except for y'all, but uh, he mentioned that the red jerseys y'all wore tonight. I said, I talked about it on the broadcast, you had your names on the back. You know, I think you said last year y'all played, you know, 47 games and only one game. You know, you were here last year, Kayla, y'all played with the red jerseys. So getting to bring out those red jerseys, what, what is the meaning of that? Oh, if he says wear your red jersey, we're all excited about it because, you know, just like he always tells us, we have our name on the back, so that's letting people know who we are. And they'll be like, oh, hey, that's so-and-so. So, I mean, it's, it's, uh, it's really big. We all love to wear them. And... Like he said on the bus, he said, red makes you think of blood, and, you know, blood brings out competition, and I really think we, we did. We came out and competed tonight. Uh, we're on a six-game losing streak. It's the truth. The truth hurts sometimes, and trust me, I don't want to lose six in a row. I know y'all don't either, but we're only 0-2 in the division, so we come back at home, play two games against Delta Friday. One, do y'all know anything about the team and uh, getting to play back in front of the home crowd, which we've only done that once all year? Uh, Lindsay, if you can answer that, what does that mean, getting to come back and play at home? Show them what we have and just play how we can. You know, we, like I said, we're only 0-2 in the division. Um, the, the same thing happened last year, which I think we started off 2-6 and six in the division. So in order to get that momentum back and to, and to get the team rallied around, what do you think we need to do in the next, you know, few weeks? Uh, we definitely have to keep hitting like we have been, and we got to cut down on our errors in the field. Two disappointing losses tonight, fall 4-3 to three and 7-6, to six, but we return to the field on Friday. Uh, congratulations on individual efforts, and hopefully uh, we rebound with a couple of wins on Friday.